And here we, we can see that uh, you know, which market has done better, which market has done well. And we have a chart. This is the U.S. market, different sectors, different sectors and different market caps. And recently, we actually added a feature which you can expand it to, uh, to cover the entire industry. So, for instance, we want to know among large caps which industry did the best. So I just uh, click on here among large, uh, large caps, uh, which industry did the best. And I just click on here. And also, for instance, if you want to know which among among the uh, mag caps, which company did best, this is today. If I want to see year to date, for instance, year to date, the mag caps, which uh, industry did the best? Actually, it, without maybe it's technology, but actually it's retail, retail, defensive retail. If I click on here, it will show us year to date. If I click on here, and uh, I, yeah, these are the companies. Uh, okay, because in retail, there's no company probably which can qualify as MacPad. Uh, this is between ten to uh, this is between ten to hundred uh, billion, uh, hundred billion uh, in market cap. If you want to see the year to date performance, I just tap year to date here. So year to date total return, and if I Display this column here. It will show us the year-to-date total return for large cap retailers and the year-to-date performance. Mostly they are up. And uh, for the okay for the mega caps, uh, for the mega caps, if we do the same thing, and if I click on here and I want to find out year-to-date total return, I just turn on this year-to-date total return display here. Okay, actually Walmart and Costco. They did really well this year, and uh, Walmart's up almost fifty percent. That's that's quite surprising. Uh, that's quite surprising. I didn't pay attention to it, but we can see that uh, it 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 tells us which sector did the best uh, this year, and uh, which sector and which market market segment. You can click on that. Of course, which one did the worst? Uh, the personal service is the worst, and the home building did poorly. Home building did very close to the worst this year. We understand that uh, due to high interest rate, uh, there were, um, okay, we need to probably need to uh, fix some problems here. Okay, uh, that's, uh, that's, that's, that's this feature. You can close it and uh, then uh, check out the sector performance course. You can and click on it to to uh, check different time year to date uh, to see which sector did the best. Communication, financial service did well actually this year, and uh, yeah, that's uh, that's the uh, the market. So which market is cheaper? When if you want to know which sector is cheaper, you can just click on the for instance U.S. market. Then go, go here, we have the different industries and uh, we, we display their P ratio, their shader P ratio. And if I just display shader P ratio, it says energy actually is, is cheap at this point. The cyclical financial service is cheap at this point. Uh, yeah, that's uh, defensive in industries, tobacco products, okay, those, those are cheap. And if you are, uh, um, Income investor, you can also look, uh, search for the industries that ha that has the highest dividend yield here. Actually, if you if you just uh, uh, scroll, scroll down, we do have a bar which allows you to switch. Uh, yeah, dividend yield. Uh, you can sort by dividend yield. Uh, sort by dividend yield. You can check out which industry has the highest. Even you, surprisingly, it's asset management has a highest index, uh, dividend yield. If we click on that and see that uh, different performances, year to date performances actually did overall pretty well. And uh, then you can check the dividend yield of different companies. Mm -hmm.